What's up guys, welcome to another video. It's been a while. Last time you saw me, I was doing my pull-up challenge for a thousand pull-ups for my birthday. So now it's that time of year again, I'm gonna do the super total. This is my second super total. It's a nice little annual checkup on my overall strength. So the super total, if you're not familiar, is one rep max, snap, clean jerk, back squat, bench press, deadlift. Put them all together and then make one big number. It is July 24th. About 7.45 a.m. Shout out to Critical Fit with the sick tank top. Go ahead and follow them here. If you're a nerd and like working out, go ahead and check out their page. Without further ado, let's get things started. Balance us off on that one, we'll retry again. Oh. 2.30, I'm gonna cut it there obviously. On to clean and jerks. Tap number one, clean and jerk. Number two, three hundo. Okay, that's my second attempt, but that's like 20 pounds higher than what I did last time. So I'm gonna call the third attempt, save my energy for the other lifts. And that's pretty good. Since I haven't really been doing a lot of Olympic weightlifting per se, but more volume to my squatting because my legs need help, which are my weakness, which is where our quad and leg strength. Um, Cause I can pull under any weight, but it's whether or not I can squat it up. So I'm really happy with that. And the fact that I've also been doing a lot of more steady state, like endurance training. So I'm glad to see <laughs> it hasn't really interfered with my strength. So on to the back squats. I squatted 405 the other day, um, so I knew I had the capacity to do 405. Uh, I just wanted to hit 400, obviously because I got deadlifts later on today too. So I wanted to hit 400 because I know I could hit 405. Stay a little conservative. I'm gonna move on to bench now, give my legs a little bit of rest, but uh, that's huge, that's good. And I would not recommend going backwards into racks like that. Don't copy what I'm doing, kids. Stay in school. All right, bench pressed, 10 number one, 225. My bench isn't really that special. Poverty bench, life. Hashtag. All right, 250 actually moved pretty good. All right, we're just going for it. 270, last of 10. Yeah! All right, 
did not expect that from my bench. Uh, that's huge. That's like 20 pound PR. Getting one step closer out of poverty. <laughs> Getting closer to the 300 bench mark. So on to deadlifts, then we're done for today. Attempt number one, 100 for two, so I knew I could do 505 for one with a belt. Um, so I'm gonna call it there, and we're all done finally. So I'll start getting a little tired and hungry. Ended the day with 230 snatch, 300 clean and jerk, 400 squat, 270 bench, and a 505 deadlift all coming out to a 1705 total, which is almost 100 pounds more than last year, which is freaking awesome. Uh, I got like 1630 last time. That I've been doing this on top of a lot of endurance training too. So a lot of running. It definitely can be done. Um, there's this thing called the interference effect. It basically comes down to your nutrition and how you space out your sessions. Program your training to where the endurance doesn't affect the strength and vice versa. And you shouldn't have a problem. People call it hybrid training, concurrent training. Um, but I like doing both because I don't do a lot of CrossFit like I used to. But I really enjoy running lately. But so there's that. Big shoes to fill for next year. So uh, now I can focus on other things. Like I want to get a sub 25K, which has always been a goal of mine. So I can put all my efforts and uh, focus onto that now, now that this is over and I peaked for that. So uh, thank you guys for watching. Catch you guys in the next